the digital certificate isn't uh, completely bilingual as is required and there's a big section of information around eight lines in total that have no corresponding Irish translation and also as it happens the name of the country is incorrect on the cert it says Republic of Ireland and we all know that uh, the name of our country is ERA or Ireland. Um, why and how did this happen and Will these lines be completely translated going forward for any digital certs yet to issue? Uh, thanks, Deputy. Um, I'm going to hand over to Murish, if that's OK, Murish. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, Deputy. Uh, I just want to acknowledge the error uh, in the use, um, incorrect use of the, the name of the country uh, is, is being corrected going forward. And with the COVID uh, digital app, uh, when the paper certs are sort of scanned into people's digital wallets on the phone, if they choose to do that, uh, that would automatically correct the error on, on the name of the country. And I take personal responsibility for that. It was the Department of Health that were the issuing authority. And it was just with the pace of work underway, that was an oversight that I'm sorry for. Um, the form, the, the structure of the form otherwise, is I would say fixed. Um, we uh, have a, a, a balance of Irish and English in the form, and it would be uh, would be unwise of us to adjust the form. The form is the one recognised all over the European Union now. Excuse and I'm sorry, I, I was just question. referring to. It, it's supposed to be completely bilingual, and there's a large section with eight lines that is just in English. So when will the Irish uh, translation of these uh, lines in that particular section be made available. It's a legal requirement. I'll have to come back on that, Deputy. Um, it, we, it would be, it, 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 there'd be a lot of considerations to take account of in adjusting the form. It is shared across the European Union, it's interoperable, uh, and it has a lot of features. The, the requirement to have the form completely bilingual was flagged well back as far back as April. And it's completely inconceivable that this wasn't an issue when you were planning this. And I know that it's probably difficult to do it now, but do you not see the big error there by not making the form bilingual? Uh, there's a balance of Irish and English in the forms there, I have in front of me. There, now there's not a balance. There, I'm sorry, it's supposed to be completely translated. There's some bits of Irish in it, but it's not completely in Irish. And while I'm on that topic, the translation isn't even correct. And there's a number of big errors within the translation as well. And it doesn't make sense. Um, for example, the line there, disease or agent targeted, is completely incorrectly translated. And it actually, the, the Irish meaning of that is that the person that holds the certificate has COVID-19. So uh, are you telling me that the, first of all, the whole form isn't going to be available bilingually and the very big errors in the translation of the certificate won't be rectified? Deputy, could I suggest we come back to you on, 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 on those points? Well, it's, it's a simple yes or no answer. I would say all of the essential pieces of information on the form specified by the by the regulation in Europe are in both languages. Uh, we look into it. I have the form in front of me right now. Um, we'll look into it and we'll see what we can do. Thank you. Um, well, I, I'm not satisfied with those answers, to be honest. You've said that you're not going to change it, basically. Um, and it's supposed to be completely bilingual. And they, to, to actually have very bad translation. I want to know how the, the form was translated as badly as it was. Deputy, was it uh, translated in-house or was there an out, outside translation um, company used? Um, I haven't that information right now. I think it was an outside um, contracted to the civil service. Okay, well, if you could get back to me on those specific questions,